Thank you guys so much for joining us. Good morning, and we are thrilled to have you here as we kick off this exciting day of generosity for the city of Lubbock. My name is Cassie Johnston. I am the executive director and co-founder of a local nonprofit called Allstrom Angels, and I'm the campaign director for the Lubbock movement of Giving Tuesday. Giving Tuesday, which always falls on the Tuesday after Thanksgiving this year on November 29th, was founded in 2012 by the 92nd Street Y in New York City and the United Nations Foundation as a philanthropic response to Black Friday and Cyber Monday. In just four short years, Giving Tuesday has engaged more than 30,000 organizations across 71 countries, and I am so proud that Lubbock now stands among the world leaders of generosity. The essence and spirit of Giving Tuesday is to harness the collective power of a unique blend of partners, nonprofits, businesses, corporations, media, as well as families and individuals to transform how people think about, talk about, and participate in the giving season. I'd like to recognize some of our nonprofit, business, and corporate sponsors for Lubbock's second annual Giving Tuesday campaign. First and foremost, I'd like to thank Hamill Brothers Studios for taking the vision for Giving Tuesday LBK and bringing it to life on the screen so that people all across the South Plains can be a part of giving history. I would also like to thank the Board of Directors for local nonprofit Ulster Angels. In particular, I'd like to thank Melissa Dudley, who is our Development Director has put a lot of heart and soul and blood and everything else she has into this campaign, so thank you. And the Community Foundation of West Texas, who has become an active partner for us in bringing the Giving Tuesday movement to the city as a collaborative effort. And now I would like to introduce our Giving Tuesday legacy sponsor, Wes Jackson, Chief Merchandise Officer for United Supermarkets. Good morning, everyone. Um, at United Supermarkets, we're really eager to have our stores serve as giving locations for this great event. All Market Streets, United's, Amigos, and Lubbock, Plainview, Leveland, Slayton, and Post will not only serve as a, uh, where we'll provide a spot for the volunteer table within our stores, we'll also uh, enable our, our guests to donate through our register in, in all of those stores all day long on Tuesday, November 29th. So we're so fortunate to live in the communities that we live in. We live in very generous uh, communities. And at United, we're honored to support this event uh, by making it more convenient for, for folks to participate. So thank you very much. Okay, at this time, I'd like to introduce our exclusive shirt sponsor for the 2016 Giving Tuesday campaign shirts, City Councilman and CEO of Advanced Graphics and The Matador, Mr. Steve Massengill. Thanks, Cassie. Uh, the Matador and Advanced Graphics feel so honored and privileged to participate and sponsor this event, I, or, th or this movement, rather. I don't know of a better way to celebrate the giving season in a more giving community than to kick it off with Giving Tuesday in Lubbock, Texas. So uh, as you can see, there's a lot of participation in this room. I'm going to tell you how everybody at home can participate. So you see all these wonderful t-shirts everybody has on. Uh, you can buy one for yourself at the Matador. And we, what, our location at 98th and Quaker across from Blue Sky, we will have them available. And proceeds go back to um, the uh, Giving Tuesday the, I guess the Community Foundation of Lubbock and Alstrom's Angels here, they're, they're, they're the custodians of those funds. And so those shirts are available right now. They've been available since last week. And uh, you can purchase as many as you want there or just one. And uh, proceeds go back uh, for a great cause. So thanks again. Thanks for all the nonprofits that ha are participating, all the sponsors. And I would encourage everyone to go out and get your shirt and take your unselfie and uh, po post on social media that you're excited about Giving Tuesday. Thank you.
Thank you so much. Um, and just to kind of follow up on um, what we just talked about with the Matador, there are 73 nonprofits participating in Giving Tuesday this year. So when anyone in the community goes out and purchases one of their unselfie shirts to wear on Giving Tuesday, those proceeds help all 73 nonprofits. I couldn't think of a better way to make an impact and touch every charity that makes Lubbock a great place to live. So go out and get your unselfie shirts, take pictures and, and post them all over social media. Okay, and then I would like to introduce one other person who has been very instrumental since the beginning in helping us get Giving Tuesday off the ground, get some of the key people that we needed to get support from within the community, Mr. Rick Dykes. Thank you, Cassie. Wouldn't you like to have her energy every day? <laughs> you know, isn't Lubbock a great place to live in West Texas? You know, the great thing about Giving Tuesday is it's one day out of the year that we take, that we give outside of what we normally do. And it's a great way to make a charitable contribution. But you know, we also need to remember that these 73 organizations need our help throughout the year. And there's so many different ways that you can help them, not only monetarily, but you know, there's people out there that need clothes for clothes drives and food for food drive. So, you know, Lubbock is always known as a place that takes care of its own. And I'm so proud to be here in West Texas. And please support Giving Tuesday. It's, we're off to a great start. It's no surprise that we rank in the top two or three in the country since we started it. I expect this time next year we'll be number one. So let's all, let's all dig, dig deep and uh, let's make next Tuesday really special for everybody. Thank you. Okay, and um, I'm going to ask at this time for the Community Foundation of West Texas, who has partnered with All Stream Angels to bring Giving Tuesday to the city of Lubbock. Um, I'm going to ask Michelle Stevens, who is the Vice President of Development, to say a few words. Thank you, Cassie. Um, I found the little notes here. When the Giving Tuesday movement arrived in Lubbock in 2015, the Community Foundation of West Texas knew we needed to participate. Giving Tuesday is an opportunity for the community to come together and have more impact with those participating in the campaign. The Community Foundation of West Texas believes that charitable giving should be easy, flexible, and effective. As the only local community foundation, we award grants to hundreds of nonprofits throughout Lubbock. The agencies who are participating are ones that we receive grant applications from throughout the year and have awarded many of you. It only makes sense for us to work beside each of you on this day of giving. This year, we have again donated $10,000 to matching funds to help all of the 73 nonprofits. And any money, an additional, any money that the Community Foundation raises through our platform, we will turn back into you guys as well. So we will not keep any. We raise funds to support the community throughout the year, and Giving Tuesday should not be any different. Let's go out and make an impact. Well, I didn't know she was going to say that. That's really great. Thank you, Michelle. We're so excited and blessed to have your generosity. Okay, at this time, I would like to invite Mayor Pro Tem Latrell Joy up to issue our proclamation so that we can kick the 2016 Giving Tuesday off. Good morning. Is everybody up and at them this morning? I know a lot of you because I've seen you doing your work in the community. Uh, I think it's awesome that you're all here this morning. You know, this movement is one of the reasons that Mayor Dan Pope says it's a great day to live in Lubbock, Texas. And I think that is true because we're a very generous community and we give not only of money, but of your time as well. This special recognition today Whereas Giving Tuesday is held on the Tuesday following Thanksgiving Day, Black Friday, and Cyber Monday, and was established to allow people to come together, celebrate generosity, and help their community by demonstrating a charitable spirit of giving. And whereas Ostrom Angels, the Community Foundation of West Texas, and United Supermarkets of Lubbock are bringing Giving Tuesday to our city as a community transformation project. 
And whereas Giving Tuesday is a wonderful opportunity for the people of Lubbock and West Texas to come together to make a difference and to improve the community by generously donating to their favorite charity. And whereas it is appropriate to observe Giving Tuesday and recognize the tremendous impact of philanthropy, volunteerism, and community service. Now therefore, we the mayor and city council of the great city of Lubbock do hereby recognize November 29th, 2016 as Giving Tuesday in Lubbock and encourage all citizens to serve this day by serving, donating, and giving back to the community. Dated this 22nd day of November, 2016, signed by Mayor Dan Pope and all of the members of the City Council. Congratulations to all of you. Okay, thank you so much, Mayor Pro Tem Joy, for being here and helping us um, kick this, this um, exciting day off the way it should be, big, West Texas style. And with that, before we cut the ceremonial ribbon and officially start the day, I'd like to um, say a quote that Senator Charles Perry said in his letter of support for Giving Tuesday LBK. He wrote, there is a reason they call us the giant side of Texas. When we see others in need, we don't just ask, what can we do? We ask, what can we provide? Please take time to give a gift to your favorite local charity on Giving Tuesday. Let's show the world that it is indeed the giant hearts of the people of West Texas that make us the giant side of Texas. Okay, are we ready? Everyone scissors ready? And three, two, one. On Giving Tuesday, there'll be representatives from all 73 nonprofits at all of the United locations. People can give in person there, or they can go online to givingtuesdaylbk.org and give to their favorite charity until 11.59 p.m. Progress and media updates will be given from the 98th and Quaker Market Street location, and we will be there from 6 a.m. till 10.30 p.m. All right, on behalf of all of the nonprofits participating in the 2016 Giving Tuesday LBK campaign, thank you for joining us. We'll open the floor to any questions and interviews with agencies. Let's go forth and change the world. <laughs> <laughs>